Hey y'all, Emma down here at Camping World, and I've got something super exciting to show you. We just got in a 2024 Thor Chateau 22E, and this thing is amazing. This Chateau is sitting on a Ford E350 chassis with a very powerful V8 that's going to get you where you need to go, when you need to go. Let's take a look at this thing. So, outside looking in, this is definitely a compact couples coach, and it's amazing for traveling. The side view mirrors do have cameras on the outside so you can monitor your surroundings and the, they are power mirrors as well. So you can adjust those while you're traveling if you're needing to see different angles or if the road or conditions are changing. Coming along the side of the coach, first thing is going to be the freshwater reservoir. This reservoir is great for if you're boondocking or you're camping somewhere that does not have water available. You can fill this reservoir up and then turn the water pump on and it's going to fill your coach with water anywhere you need it in the faucets or the shower or the toilet. Coming along, you're going to have a 4000i flex power generator. One awesome thing about this generator is it's fed directly from the fuel tank. So you can get gas anytime you need as long as you have fuel in that fuel tank. This unit does have an on-demand hot water heater. An amazing thing about this on-demand hot water heater is if you're like me, you like taking hot showers that last a lot longer than five minutes, on-demand hot water is gonna keep that water flowing as hot as you need it for a good period of time. It is equipped with an outdoor shower with hot and cold apparatuses and the shower head is removable so you can prep food outside, wash the pets off, wash yourself off for the kids if you're getting dirty or muddy um, before you get inside your beautiful coach. It is TV prepped on the outside. It has a coax right here and it's a Furion system. This Furion system is awesome so you can have your outdoor entertainment whenever and wherever you want it. It is a 30 amp coach. Shore power is located right here. And if you're at a campground that does have that power available, you can just hook up directly and power your coach fully. The dump station is located in a very convenient location. You have black water and gray water dump handles right here. Um, they did color coordinate those so you don't get confused on which handle you are pulling and it makes the uh, dump station very convenient. It is a gas unit um, and to fill up it's actually located right here. Very easy, it's your traditional style. Right here this is the black water flush. This black water flush uh, as opposed to your traditional flush systems where you have to run a water hose inside your coach and put it inside your toilet they took that away and made it super convenient for RV owners. You just hook up your water hose right here. It has four jets inside that black tank, and those jets are gonna clean out any solids or waste that could be accumulating within that tank. And your city water connection is located right beside that. If you're not boondocking and you're at a campsite that does have water available, you can just hook a water hose up right here, and that's gonna supply your coach with water. Coming around the back, you do have a 4x4 rear end. This is great for storage when it comes for your dump station hoses, so you don't have to put that inside of your coach and worry about any spillage or any troubles with those uh, dump station hoses. It already has a backup camera installed in the third brake light, so that's going to give you maximum visibility on the very rear of this coach. It is towable up to 8,000 pounds, so if you're traveling with another vehicle or you have you know, some toys, ATVs, four-wheelers, or anything of that nature, or you're just towing a utility trailer, you can hook up. It has a seven-way uh, plug on it, so it makes the, the ability very easy. It does have a uh, ladder on the very back, so it does have a walkable roof. If you ever just need to get up there and inspect anything, if you're treating your roof or going up there to do any cleaning, Easily, easily accessible, so you're not having to lean a ladder up against your brand new coach and scratch anything up. It's already pre-installed. They thought about all this prior to uh, design. Right here, you're going to have your entertainment. You have a huge profile awning over here with an LED strip that runs underneath, so you're going to get maximum visibility at night or while you're entertaining. Located right here, you have your saddlebag storage and a huge, huge underbelly storage. So when it comes to packing camping gear or getaway gear, you have a ton of room in here for all of your storage needs. You have two 110 outlets located right out here. So if you've got um, any electronic devices or you're running any extra TVs or entertainment, you definitely have the power set right out here. It is equipped with a Connex TV. A lot of people ask me, Emmett, What's the point of having a TV on the outside if it's just going to be jumbling around? Awesome thing about these Connex TVs is they are insulated. So that means while you're traveling, you're not going to have to worry about that TV jumping around and damaging any internal electronics. Right underneath your entertainment center right here, you're going to have your propane hookup. Propane's super easy on this. It has a very easy uh, refill valve 
and everything is regulated. It does have a regulator installed on it. So if that propane is turned on while you're stationary, you don't have to worry about your coach filling with water, or excuse me, with propane, and you won't be getting sick or you won't put yourself in danger. Let's take a look at the inside. All right, guys, now that we're inside this beautiful 22E, I'd love to show you around. Located right up front in the cockpit, you're going to have your uh, navigation system, radio, AC controls, tons of storage. You have cup holders, dash storage, little cubbies. The very two front seats are going to be captain seats and the passenger seat is fully reclinable. So if you're going on those long road trips or going to your destination, um, the passenger can kick back and relax or when you're switching seats because you're driving 12 hours, you can ride in comfort. Up top, you do have another sleeping arrangement. One cool thing that Thor does is they put a safety net on here. This safety net prevents anybody from falling. If you have littles or just company, or if y'all are sleeping up there, um, you can ease your mind knowing that this uh, safety net's located right there. And to my left, there is a swivel mount TV. This swivel mount TV will come out fully so you can entertain. Um, and it gives you a really good scope, especially when you're sitting at your dinette. This dinette is awesome. It is a fixed dinette, which makes it very easy to travel with. All you have to do is push it down, get this cushion out of the way, push that down until it's seated. You'll pull these back covers off. And you have another sleeping arrangement. So not only are you getting your overhead sleeping, you have dinette sleeping, and then you also have a fixed bed, which we'll get to here momentarily. One thing that's great is I was talking about little sleeping up top. Right here, you do have a car seat holder or a car seat uh, anchor point. So, so they take safety very seriously on these. Located right up top, you're going to have a ton of overhead storage. It is strut assisted on this overhead storage, so you don't have to worry about these falling down and hitting you on the head. And right underneath that, you do have individual reading lights that you can toggle and your indoor speakers are located there as well. Right above me, you're going to have a GE rooftop unit. This rooftop unit is great. You can adjust your temperature fully right here, adjust your vents, open and close, so you can really get the achieved temperature settled inside of your coach. I'm going to squeeze on by and we're going to come right over here. You are going to have a huge closet and storage space located right here. It is going to have a built-in clothes rack and then it also comes with a ladder. That ladder is uh, fixed right here on the wall and it does have an anchor point. Underneath that, you're gonna have your furnace. This furnace is in a really great central location. So if you're sleeping at your bed, you have people sleeping on the dinette and somebody overhead, I mean, it's gonna put out a ton of heat. And again, just tons of fully recessed storage. Your restroom is gonna be located right over here. And as you can tell, it's got a ton of room. The shower has a gorgeous color pattern going on with a skylight right above me. Removable shower head so you can get your business taken care of and make it very easy. You have a vanity fixed right here and medicine cabinet. Stainless steel sink in the bathroom, stainless steel faucet. And then you have more storage located under here for linens, toiletries, or anything that you're needing. The Medic Foot Flush Toilet makes that uh, flushing very easy, not have to worry about your hands, you just push it down with your foot. Directly across from me, you're going to have your water heater control panel. With this water heater control panel, you can adjust the temperature of that water that's coming out of your sinks and your shower head. So if you want a really hot water, you can set it, forget it, and just... So, directly outside of the restroom, you're going to have your bed. This bed is fixed and it has a ton of room. You're gonna get a lot of natural light outside of the bed with two windows and emergency exit located right on the side of the bed and a ton of overhead storage again. This is recessed storage and it's not segmented, so you're gonna get the most amount of space out of this overhead storage. And you do get a skylight right above the bed. Adds a really natural flare over here in the bedroom area. The fridge does have a travel lock, which is super convenient. So if you're in any bumpy roads or any rough terrain, you don't have to worry about those doors flying open and losing your um, items that are located in your fridge. It is going to be a 12 volt fridge freezer combo with a ton of room. You have uh, storage compartments, you have a slide storage compartment, a couple shelves, and you do have an oversized freezer. So best thing about these residential style units is you can pack up for a long trip and not have to worry about running out of supplies. Right beside the fridge, we're going to get to the kitchen area. 
you are going to have a fixed microwave right above the stove top, a fully functional range vent. Sometimes people ask if these are for show. So if you're cooking, you have some steam, some smoke coming up, you can just turn that fan on and it will power extract it through the top of the unit. Uh, so you don't have to worry about filling your coach with smoke or smog. You do have a good sized oven that can fit a standard size pizza. Um, maybe even a small bird so when you're on vacation you don't have to worry about cutting back or putting anything uh, any plans on hold and located right underneath there you are going to have another storage area you do have one piece solid countertops so best thing about the one piece solid countertops is longevity any, any weak points or cure points you just have one solid piece and you have tons of storage this right here is just a little uh, access door. You can put utensils or any small items, sponges, wash tools. And then you also have fully recessed storage underneath here. You do have a deep stainless steel and sink with a grate that goes over it. And then a beautiful bronze goldish high rise gooseneck. This is great for any prep space. If you're washing anything that you don't need to. There is also a leaf for added prep space. Metal blinds are located right here opposed to the kitchen. Metal blinds are really great because anytime you have heat or fire you don't want anything that's flammable so they really took that safety into consideration and they went with a color that really suits this coach. And above you're going to have a ton of storage space. These shelving or the shelving inside of these cabinets is adjustable so depending on the size of the items that you're storing you can adjust the height of the shelving. Underneath here, you do have easy access lights to turn on or off any um, accessory lights that are within the coach. And one of the best parts about this is the convenience center. So this convenience center is going to run just about everything. You have your quick battery disconnect, so you don't have to worry about draining your coach batteries. You can control your awning in and out, awning lights, the step lights, and the cargo lights. You do have your main coach lights, and this does have solar on the go, so it does have a solar system on it that will um, auxiliary charge the coach batteries and run the interior lights. Located right above that is the last part of this coach. You do have your generator access right here that shows how many hours your generator is running. The stop and start. Stop, you hold that for about five seconds to prime that generator, and then you can start it up. And like I said, that generator feeds directly from the fuel tank. So you don't have to worry about running running out of fuel or not having power. Then you do have digital readouts for your propane, black gray water tanks, fresh water tank, and battery. And the water pump I was talking about earlier for boondock camping can be turned on right there. So if you don't have a uh, direct water inlet from a campsite, then you can turn that water pump on just to make sure that everything through your coach is operable. Guys, there's so much to get excited about on this Thor 22E. Come on down to Camping World Van Buren, Arkansas. Come see me, Emmett, and we'll get you camping this weekend.